The House will be in order. Whether presiding over the House of Representatives. And I didn't even feel it. Or bearing her arm in a comforting gesture for black constituents skeptical about the safety of the COVID-19 vaccine. 7th District Congresswoman Terry Sewell sees it all as a part of her season of service. I'm a very proud product of Alabama's rural black belt uh, growing up in Selma. And I know that if we don't help home, if we're not committed to a season of service to give back to those communities, who will? Proud but humbled by her place in Alabama history as the first African-American woman to represent our state in Congress. She's not content to hold on to that distinction. It's not about one person having the opportunity. It's about breaking down the door and allowing so many others to have the same kinds of opportunities. 2020 broke down the doors to the White House with the election of Senator Kamala Harris as vice president. A moment Representative Sewell relished not only as a fellow Democrat, but as Harris's Alpha Kappa Alpha sorority sister. Here you see her wearing the sorority's signature pearls and pink and green colors at the inauguration. But I also wrote my senior thesis in college on black women in politics. Our time has come. America is just now catching up. Now that was in 1980, <clears throat> but I can truly say that with the 117th Congress, uh, we've seen more women in politics than ever before. And more women are walking the halls of Congress as senators and as House uh, representatives than ever before. But the daughter of Selma's first black city councilwoman recognizes the legacy of her district is civil rights. So I look forward to ultimately being the sponsor of the bill that passes the House and the Senate and that is signed into law that will fully restore the Voting Rights Act. I think that that would be a befitting tribute to John Robert Lewis, Alabama's native son um, and my mentor. A legacy she intends to honor. You know, I believe that black excellence and black achievement is, um, it occurs one step, one person at a time. That, that as we are given these great opportunities, um, what we do with it matters. For as long as her season of service lasts. Carla Wade, WVTM 13.